Alright guys, this is L'Oreal Infallible 24 Hour Never Fail Lip Color in 200 Tea Berry. This is my first time using the L'Oreal Infallible Lip Colors, so let me go ahead and open it. And here goes a nothing. This is, it says step one, apply a thin layer of lip color to clean lips. For best results, let dry for two minutes. So we're gonna do that first whenever I can get it out of here. All right, L'Oreal. How are we supposed to get these things out of here? And then it has them numbered also at the top. This is one and then two. Um, maybe you just do it like that, like a cigarette lighter. Yeah, we'll see. Oh, that's pretty. It's like a rose color. It kind of clashes with my eye makeup, but that's alright. At least it's not too ashy. Kind of like a <laughs> 80's Barbie doll. Okay, this is let sit for two minutes, so I'm going to do that. And while I let it, allow it to dry, step two says apply the conditioning balm to seal the color and provide a natural shine. Remove with an oil-based lip remover. So I will sit here until it dries. All right, so I believe it's dry. Now we're gonna move on to step two. And this is what the sealer looks like. I'm not even gonna roll it up that much. Miss my look. Okie smokey. And then I like how they don't come out so you can keep the whole thing together. That's really cute. And then it has a mirror. You can check yourself out. All right, it is 12.33 and yes, I do have a new phone so no more of that crack screen. <laughs> so it's 12.33 and I will come back um, in a few hours to let you know how it's held up so far and my next thoughts. All right, catch you guys in a bit. Bye. It is 4.30 and I have not reapplied the lipstick. Obviously the color is still on there, but my lips, they don't feel dry, but they look dry. So I'm going to reapply the, what is this called? The step two. If I can get it off of here. All right, and then I'll check back at the end of the night. Hey guys, it's 11.44 p.m. and I am absolutely about to go to bed, but I just wanted to come back and show you guys the final lip. Um, the lip color, it turns kind of into a stain. I'm guessing that's obviously what it is, but it turns into a lip stain and my lips are kind of chapped and up in here, like in the inner area. And I bet if I put the, the gloss back on, it'll kind of bring the color back out more. It's a little more faint than it was when I originally put it on. But I obviously am going to wear it again. And I really, I really like the color. I think it's a nice color. And I like how it actually turns out to be a more subtle pink than even when I put it on originally. Um, my pros are that I really like the color and I mean it does last I don't know who wears lipstick for 24 hours but it's lasted long enough for me and I would definitely suggest purchasing and um, I think next time I will be sure to put more of the product on and be sure to let it dry completely because I don't think I let it dry completely and a con I would say is that it, of course because your lips are wet on the inside here it doesn't um, stay on the inner parts of your lips and it kind of dries your lips out um, as the day goes on but once you put that gloss back on it's perfectly fine the color does not transfer but the gloss 
transfers. If you have tried this L'Oreal Infallible 24 hour lip color, please let me know what color you've tried below and I'm, I'd like to try out different color, another color as well. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, and thumbs up this video if you liked it and found it helpful. And of course, this L'Oreal is not a new lipstick, but I enjoyed it and I definitely would repurchase. All right, I'll catch you guys in my next one. Bye.